What's up guys? So today we're gonna do another retake on the video that we did about a week ago where we saw if race had anything to do with you know, you asking for money and see if people would help you out. Uh, we saw that race really didn't have nothing to do with it, but we want, we want to see if gender has something to do with it. So what we're going to do is we're not going to try guys. We saw that basically we tried like 15 people and only one person said yes to a guy. So now we're going to try Maria. Maria to see if she can get any person, anybody to help her out. So um, we have Maria over there in her car and we're going to test it out. And today's video is sponsored by our partner Skillshare. So Skillshare is something that I love a lot because it's a place where I can learn a lot. For example, right now I wanted to learn more about stocks. So I've been taking this course and I love it. This thing gives you the one-on-one about how to invest and, and what is a broker, for example. It just gives you the basics, the basic foundation. Um, if you guys are interested in stocks, this is one that you have to look at and watch because you're going to learn a lot of the basics. What I like about Skillshare is that it's a huge community. There's about 26,000 um, classes in there that you can learn and it can be for music or stocks like I'm doing right now and if you get the premium membership it gives you unlimited access to all that information where you can just soak everything in and if you get the annual subscription you can get it for around ten dollars a month so whether you want to fuel your curiosity career or even creativity Skillshare is the place to go and now this is the best part you can join over seven million creators right now for free for the first 500 people to click the link down below and join Skillshare it will be for free for two months and you're gonna get unlimited access to everything so you have nothing to lose so check out Skillshare guys I'll have the link down below and you the first 500 people will get Skillshare for free for two months so you can soak up all that information in two months whatever it is you want to do if you want to start your new business learn about stocks or just learn a musical instrument Skillshare is the place to go so now let's go right now and see how many people will say yes to Maria to help her out for Five bucks of fuel gas. Oh, this so, is so embarrassing. Who promised did it? Like nothing. Yeah, I'd rather go up to guys. This is. Uh, are you ready? Oh, okay, bye. to bother you so i'm from palm beach and i left my wallet hold on hold on just one second i'm sorry i'm sorry to bother you so i'm from palm beach and i left my wallet and i'm trying to get back home is there any way you can like lend me like five dollars to put gas in my car i'm doing a social experiment i just wanted to see what you would say you don't have to give me money i have money oh okay but thank you for giving i just wanted to see if people were kind enough to do it thank you that was nice of you <laughs> I wouldn't take your money. <laughs> yeah, he was like, yeah, that's fine. He's like, I got you. I was like, no, no, I'm doing a social experiment for school. I was like, don't worry about it. I was like, I wouldn't take your money. He's like, no, man, if you need it. I was like, no, it's fine. Um, yeah, that's what. Maria, one for one. She went to the first guy, and he said yes. Um, she told him it was for a social experiment. So he, but he was still like, if you need it, I got it. So one yes one out of one so let's go see maybe we can get three or four more and um and see how many of them still right, i'm gonna go in front of you like around your car you know like other way all right excuse me ma'am i'm sorry i have a quick question so i'm from west palm and i forgot my wallet is there any way you can give me like five dollars for gas yeah see so you like wait a minute okay okay no, just I just, I'm doing a social experiment. I wanted to see if you were willing to give me some. You don't have to give me any. Oh. No, no, no. Oh. But I wanted to see if people were willing to give me. Give me money. money. No, <laughs> no, I'm good. But I just wanted but to I see. I have to tell you something. That yes. You picked the right person because my son was abroad for a year. Yeah. And he was coming home with a couple hundred dollars. He was uh, in an AFS program. In okay. To Greece. Yeah. He was coming home with a couple hundred dollars. And his ticket, everything was in his wallet. Uh huh. At the airport, he got pickpocketed. No. And a guy gave him twenty-five dollars to get. Uh, they confirmed his. They confirmed his uh, ticket. Yeah. And so he got on the plane, but the guy gave him twenty-five dollars so he could have some money to get home. Oh, that's awesome. And he wrote him back. 
and he took his name out and he wrote him back and everything yeah. and I was so happy that someone would do that. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Have a great day. Me too. Bye. Excuse me. I have a quick question. Yes. So I left my wallet at home and I'm trying to get a West Palm. Is there any way you can lend me five bucks or ten bucks? No, I'm good. I'm doing a social experiment and I wanted to see if people are willing to give money. That's it. I don't want to take your money. Don't worry. I have my wallet. I'm going to go try somebody else. Thank you. <laughs> Okay, well, two each isn't bad. I have a quick question. Okay. All right. All right, bye. So sorry to interrupt you. That's all right. I'm trying to get a West Palm and I forgot my wallet at home. Is there any way you can lend me $5? I just got debit cards. Okay. I'm so yeah, sorry. Right. It's okay. Thank you. Hi, I have a quick question. So I left. So I'm trying to get a West Palm and I left my wallet at home. Do you have five dollars I can spare? No, but I have to. Yeah. No. Okay, thank you. All right, so we saw that Maria out of five people, three said yes, two said no. Um, two guys, one old lady, and then the last two that said no were older ladies. So maybe gender has to do with it, you know what I'm saying? I, I guess like the guy sees, you know, that damsel in distress and the, the, the older lady probably saw they like, <laughs> yeah, they didn't care about him or him, you know, grown ass men. Um, so grown ass men don't care about grown ass men or women don't care about you guys. That, that's fucked up. I would, I would have done it for, a, for anyone. Anyone. And le one of the one lady that said yes, she said that her grandson got pickpocketed. So she had that connection with. That they gave him money to get back home. So she's like, you know, you picked the right person because I'm giving money. And I was like, oh, exactly. So gender. You know, helps. It helps to be a woman. You know what I'm saying? Lost a bet today. Oh, these guys had a bet that you had to wake up early in the morning. Be at be in the whoa. whoa. Yeah, just be at the at the gym at what time? Five thirty. Five thirty. So you had to be at the gym. Yeah, he takes an hour to poop. Five minutes to get ready, and then I take twenty minutes to get up because I can't just get up like that. I gotta, you know, take it easy because I get dizzy. Then I poop, then I get ready, and then I go to the gym. You, you poop in the morning? Yeah, you don't poop in the morning? <laughs> so when you're squatting, you don't have to poop? I mean, I'm not, I mean, I don't Let me see your squats. Show us, us, show us the squats. Oh. Come on, bro. Oh, the <laughs> so you guys bet, what, a thousand bucks, bro, right? he played me. Yeah, this he guy, hustled you, bro. He hustled me so bad. He hustled bro. you. He said, I don't think I could take a thousand dollars from you. I mean, I feel bad. I don't think I, you know, I don't. I won't take a thousand dollars from you. So he wanted. He knew that he was gonna. Yeah, stop. he was gonna give up soon. Right. And so he lowered it to two hundred. He 200? went to five hundred. Okay. And then he went down to two hundred. And then we spoke about this on Monday, right? Was it Monday? About the two hundred. We shook hands on it. Today he didn't show up. Are we talking about Thomas's family? Yeah. Why are you shirtless? Like, dude, nobody cares. <laughs> This guy, I just remember when you first? Came the remember when you first got here? He would walk in his boxers, yeah, and flex his legs. Now, so Thomas used to love seeing you shirtless. Nah. Right, so <laughs> so first, first the story about the first. So basically, Tomek lost. Yes, two hundred bucks. But he like we were saying, he hustled them. He hustled them. Play Thomas. Yeah. Play him. You 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 played him. You, Good. You're a douche, bro. Cause you you get sick. I'm not gonna take your money. I feel bad about talking about Josh. Josh. Wait, who? Joey. Joey. Did we talk about Joey? Yes, sir. No, we. Didn't we oh, talk Joey. About Joey. Oh, you did record. Yeah, I did record about Joey. Well, yeah, well I'll show you about Joey. A little yes, bit. Thomas has a hit. Oh, his Ross, family. We don't mess with Thomas. I'm gonna, I'm gonna get a phone call later. <laughs> yeah. Joey. Oh, I have to go. If something bad happens, let me call Joey. Yeah, Joey will handle it. What? He, called, he said, um, you're not a priority, Maria. Oh, yeah. You weren't here. So I Damn. He made at least call me boring. Damn. He then gave and said. Yo, everything I, everything I say is so, so, check this out. So, so Maria, about, Maria is going, going, is to, going Honduras. to the motherland. She's going to Honduras, Back right? To so I, I was showing Thomas how Honduras women, you know, how they look. Obviously, she's very, you know, Americanized. So she looks a bit different. So. Thomas is like, I said to Thomas, you want to go to Honduras? Oh, you're going to blend in. And, and Thomas, then is then like, Thomas is like, Thomas is like, you're going to get kidnapped. And then he's like, why? You're not a priority. That's the end. Why? You look Damn. the same. Damn. <laughs> Thomas throws a lot of shade, shade around bro. here, bro. I, I don't get it. I don't get it. I, I'm not eating to him. I know. I don't get it. I was already I was, I was saying that.
<laughs> Wasn't he bored of listening to you talk? Up until he started hanging out with us, yeah. <laughs> and they can't be there. How smooth did it go? Bro, we were working on point. This wait, 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 wait. Off from the camera. Right. Who hey. was the one that said, "I'm so glad you came back. I I'm missed you." you. Back, and then you, and then you were texting me too. I missed you. It's not the <laughs> same. No, that's true. I miss. I miss. I miss. But I'm saying that I get my words twisted around. Bro, like, <laughs> like, I'm 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 <laughs> Thomas, you can't. <laughs> okay, squat me, squat me. All right, squat. Bro, don't. I'm ready to eat it, bro. His knee was. His knees wasn't going. I felt like I was eating. I saw the little. You saw the knee, how it. You should be able to squat him. It's just. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> Damn. Squat. 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 I'm not gonna lie. Oh, got this hand. Squat Thomas. Squat me. 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 Those are slim fits. Thomas has a pair of slim fits. His going, his clubbing pants. <laughs> he right. takes those things off like leggings. Right. Oh, crap. <laughs> I was about to say Thomas can squat more than you, bro. No, no I can't. Let me try again. I got this. Oh, <laughs> damn! Try yeah, me. All right, let's see. Bro, if you drop, <laughs> yes. <laughs> Bring the up. Look at this. There you go. There you go. Did you break parallel? I can't see. No. No. Why you open Why up you so much? Up like a... Why are you opening up like that? Why are you opening his leg? Close it up. Close your leg. No. Shoulder width apart. Shoulder width, like that. Then go down. <laughs> Bro. Bro, he's gonna drop your ass. Go down. Do one, Bro. Do one, Rip. Here. Oh, that tiny. Oh, crap. <laughs> Why was that cop? No. Why are you opening up, Bro? Look, that's... Yeah. Shoulder width. Shoulder width? No, that's not shoulder width, bro. This right here? Right there. That's about shoulder width. All the way down. All the way down. You're, you're, you're <laughs> so before we continue, I just want to show you guys here uh, what we're working on. Um, still working progress. You need know, to you know, clean out the cables and add two more microphones here. But um, yeah, we're thinking about starting a podcast. Um, let us know what you guys want us to talk about, but we're gonna basically, we have an idea of what we're gonna talk about. We're gonna talk about everything. Um, business, um, give you guys business advice if you want that, um, relationship advice, um, life, you know, anything, fitness, whatever it is, um, we're going to have it right here. And so, for example, if we're gonna talk about fitness, we're gonna try to find somebody that's an expert in that area. We're trying to bring them here, or at least have them on the Skype call so we can talk about it and uh, deal with that, you know what I'm saying, and give you that advice. So we're going to have the podcast here, and also, you know, we're going to divide it in, in two, two, two sections. The first section or the second section, we haven't decided how we're going to do it, but let's say we would start with, you know, the new, a little bit of the news, what's going on in the world, um, what's trending, what's not, um, you know, anything that's going on in the US, Europe, whatever, anything, news. We're gonna talk about news real quick for the first half and then the second half we're gonna get in, into the topic that um, we would talk about. And um, yeah, so we would have a separate channel for this, for the podcast so we can talk to you guys about that. And um, we would also upload them to iTunes uh, and Spotify. That way if you're on your drive, you can listen to them and know what's going on. And, and yeah, go from there. So let us know what you think. Let us give us any input, any information, um, any topics that you want us to talk about. That way um, we can have everything ready. So yeah, but in, right now we're just, I just connected everything, um, try to test it out and it works perfectly. Um, we would have that TV back there, maybe put a little backdrop or something, but have that TV uh, connected to a computer that way we can show you guys what we're talking about. We even thought about doing like a 360 camera right in the middle, that way it can be interactive and you guys can move on your phone to see whoever's talking and focus on whoever you want to focus on while they're talking. Um, still waiting for a few things, like I said, two more mics and stands and headphones, plus a, a mixer uh, so we can have it there so we can connect everything all at once. 
and um, yeah, just clean up all that mess right there. And the cool thing about it is that everything is portable. That way we can just take it off and get on the road. If, for example, somebody wants to be part of the podcast, but they can't fly over here, or, or you know, and it's better to have it in person, and we can actually go to their place and do it from them. We can take everything to them. So yeah, that's an idea. Let us know what you think um, on the below. <laughs> now, uh, let me, let me, uh, we were talking about Joey over there. So uh, we did a little prank on the new Thomas or white Thomas or Thomas with an H, whatever you guys want to call him. And um, Thomas tried to do a prank on Thomas. So let's put a little excerpt of what happened. Right. I call the towing company. You call the cop. I won't call the cop. So you trying to prank Thomas? Thomas hasn't been pranked at all. So you're gonna prank him? He was part of my prank. Yeah. So prank you're basically him. doing... I'm basically doing the same thing they did to me my first day. <laughs> that your car was stolen? Thomas part two. He might not be mad, because he's been trying to get rid of the car. <laughs> <laughs> he might not care. He, he might be like, okay. I hate that before. <laughs> but no one laughed though, I mean. No. No, I so what, how do we do this? I'm gonna go back, I'm gonna act like I'm on the phone. So ask me, are you on the phone call with whomever? Anyone. He's like, yeah. I'm on hold, and then you go back there. And what are you gonna be doing, Jose? Me? Just walk by, like, yeah. I don't know, walk by shirtless, saying that you're doing a video. <laughs> he likes to walk around shirtless, anyways. All right, let me go. Yeah. Give, give me about five, 10 seconds. <sighs> yeah, I'm on hold. Okay. These people are on hold. Oh. So what is he saying? Ow. Apparently, he wants to, um, yeah, I think we're gonna talk with them. He's I know. He's so dramatic. Well, he really like I'm not real funny. <laughs> He's so dramatic, though. Because I didn't have any at home. Oh, why did you say that? I, I know. Jose. 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 No, Maria. Maria has both of them at home. At home. Bro, you don't. Have you noticed that Maria? You see how she stays, she stays quiet? quiet bro. <laughs> like that Porsche thing. Remember the car? That she spilled milk the in your car? She's. Is, bro, my Porsche. Did they? I don't know if this car is in there. No, right in the front. What happened, bro? Your keys are right here. Oh, this car. Did they? No, call the cops. When was the last time you were in your car? Yeah, let me call the cops. No, call the. No, call the towing company. The towing company. Call the towing company. You should call the cops. Towing company. Four seven seven. Yeah, because sometimes they tow cars yeah. if they see they're suspicious or whatever. They stole it. Bro, that, oh. they didn't tow that car. You would have heard a, a freaking tow truck pull up. But there's no way somebody's gonna steal a car in daylight. Yeah, sorry. Yeah. Actually. Okay, maybe there is. Yeah. Is that 2019 Camaro? The keys are there. Yeah, <laughs> Why are you laughing? Uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Why is that more time to do it? What happened? Let me see your car. Let me see your car. Let me see your recent. 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 Oh, <laughs> 
Thomas, you parked it right there, bro. Where? I see it. Oh, shit. You suck, Thomas. You're the worst pranker. You're the worst pranker. All the way down there, bro. The worst. All the way over the there, just because he had to walk. Right, 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 right next to him. He comes so excited. Guys, guys, I know. Hey, I know Keith. You're the worst. He was going to cry. Yeah, he was going to cry. He was going to cry. You want to cry. Come here, come here. <laughs> what were you gonna call Joey for? Who was gonna call Joey? <laughs> he's like, he's like, I know a guy. Who, who's Joey? No, 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 nothing. <laughs> You're not nothing. Bro, he gets up. He's like, wait, what? <laughs> no, you were shaking. Bro. I wanted to bro, laugh so bad. Bro, there was a, there was a truck right there, so I parked next to it. You couldn't see it. Yo, Yo. Yeah, you know he's still gonna call Joey. But, but, but your kneecaps, your kneecaps are gone, bro. Your kneecaps are gone. I don't know who Joey is. Who's Joey? He didn't call 911. He didn't call his dad. I'm gonna call Joey. Joey's a savage. I don't know. I don't know who Joey is, bro. Bro, low key, we're gonna cry. No, he was. No, he was good. He said, "Hey, Thomas, you better." No, he was good. He was good. He was good. He was into it. I was just emotional. Thomas, <laughs> 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 you have one job. Bro, it's not my fault that guy moved, bro. I parked it all the way down there. That's not all the way down there. Five parking spots. That's the same as why you parked the ground. He was out of breath when you got over the way. He was parking around. He should have parked the shit in your dog. If someone hits that car. No, it's gonna be no, I wasn't hitting it. You never know, bro. There's people here. I would have parked it over there, yeah, but it's not, uh, it's not about hitting. He didn't want to walk. I know. <laughs> <laughs> he was out of breath. He just wanted to say, "Bro, bro, 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 He's calling Joey. Joey. I don't know what the hell is Joey. Joey. And his finger was like this. Like Joey told him, only call me when it's serious. <laughs> Should I do this right now? He's like, Joey, I need you, bro. Huh? Huh? Who's Joey? I can't say. Whoa. Damn. He'll have to kill you if he says something. Nobody breaks the leg anymore. I know. I'm, I'm scared, bro. I know. I'm scared. You know Joey? I don't know what Joey is like. <laughs> I'm scared, bro. Actually, yeah, we should have raised this prank. Thomas, that's what I'm saying. No 911 calls. I better call Joey. Let me call Joey. Joey, knows. I Joey will handle this. <laughs> All right, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know what you think. Leave a comment down below. And remember to check out Skillshare. I have the link down below. So, I'll see you guys next time.